Hey YouTube, what's up guys? My name is Bablu. This is my Scarlett Moko. Her name is Scarlett because her name is so beautiful. Today guys, I'm going to be, uh, do a little video where I'm just going to get the birds used to me getting the harness around them, which I've ordered. I haven't still haven't come, but I watched a few more videos and on the video they show you what to do. And starting by getting your hands into the bird's wing and just lifting them up for a few seconds like that one two three and release and then we do the same thing with this side one two three release see the bird she's not even bothered by it nothing so when we get the harness we're gonna have to put one piece over the head like that and then the other pieces goes over the wings so we want her to get used to us touching her wings her feathers everything now us lifting up her wings like this so she gets used to it So on the video, the guy was trying to say, right, just try to, like, lift this wing up like that to the highest point, and then count one, two, three, and you release. So that the bird knows that after three, the counting was counting starts. After three, the wing is going to be released. So do the same again on this side. Go up here, lift the wing up. Yeah, most as high as we can go. One, two, three. And we want to give it a nice little tickle inside here and in the head to say she's been good for letting us do that. Excellent. Well, you are one easy bird to train. She is one easy, easy bird to train. And if you can't, if your bird does not let you um, touch her wings and all that in the beginning, guys, don't, uh, don't worry. Just take things step by step. Start by uh, letting the bird get used to your hand first, scratching your head, and then you can slowly wean yourself up to the wings and then come back again. So go there for a second. If she looks at you, come back again. And look, you can see, look, she's lifting her little feathers up for me, me to get deep inside them and give her a good little scratch. 